An improved trail in town will make it easier for residents with various levels of mobility to get out and enjoy nature. Here's Stephanie Michaud with more. The town completed renovations to the Eastman Conservation Area behind the Needham Newman School. The project was made possible through funding from the Community Preservation Act. Featuring a raised wooden boardwalk, the area is nearly a quarter mile long and supports the Needham Science Center. This whole project was a very collaborative effort with the town, between the school department, the conservation department, uh, park, and, park and recreation, parks and forestry, uh, as well as lots of other folks in town. Uh, we really came together uh, collaboratively to get through the design and the permitting and the construction of it. The wheelchair accessible area can be utilized by teachers and students to observe aquatic life and enjoy the outdoors. We have basically an outdoor classroom area. Students coming out of the school can, can gather and the teachers can kind of maybe tell them what they're going to be doing. Uh, and then you come out into the stone dust trail. Uh, the first spot you may come to is, is the boardwalk here that leads you out to a little peninsula at the edge of this small pond. Again, for students to, to take water samples or look at wildlife, turtles, frogs, things like that. There is at the end here a little step down where students can really literally get down and, and be able to take a water sample, things like that. Out further on the trail, in addition to, to more boardwalk, there's an outdoor classroom area with, with tables and, and seating. Again, for students uh, to go out and have their teachers kind of assemble the kids in one location. To avoid erosion issues, helical piers were screwed into the ground as opposed to driven, making the boardwalk environmentally friendly. In its current state, it is expected that the boardwalk will last at least 20 years with regular maintenance over time. In addition to the trail, irrigation updates were made to the multi-purpose Newman Fields. These were all rebuilt, drainage was put in, irrigation was put in, uh, really to make them sort of state-of-the-art athletic fields. Uh, and again, those are used for the whole town, um, for Little League and, as I said, Frisbee, and I think there may be other sports that use the multi-purpose field. The trail is open to the public, but it is preferred by the town for public use to remain during off-school hours. It's really a nice project. It came out really nice, and I think the, the people of Needham should come out and enjoy it and um, see, see what they got. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Stephanie Mashad.